This Planned Parenthood in Walnut Creek is under construction, which is interesting because the Northern California CEO tells me the way health care services are provided may change at local clinics depending on the Supreme Court's decision. It will certainly impact Californians' ability to access care as well. Planned Parenthood Northern California Chapter CEO Gilda Gonzalez says a recent study shows local California clinics could see a 3,000 percent increase in number of patients from out of state if the Supreme Court overturns Roe v. Wade. They also say since last year's Texas ruling dramatically limiting abortions, Planned Parenthood clinics in California have seen 80 out-of-state patients per month. I am so proud that we stand in a state like California that has publicly declared that it is a reproductive freedom state so that we know we are not alone. We are out here um, uh, in shifts from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. We found these two abortion rights opponents demonstrating outside the Walnut Creek Clinic today. They didn't want their faces shown, but did want to give us their reaction to the Supreme Court's leaked draft. We were shocked that um, it was uh, allowed the, uh, out. Our intentions, our hopes will never change, and that is that all life will be respected uh, from conception until natural death. They say they don't see any case where an abortion should be legal, even in the case of incest or rape. The unborn baby is not responsible for the rape. The, the baby still has a right to life. The Planned Parenthood NorCal CEO says if the ruling holds and Roe is overturned, they will adapt and prepare to do more to ensure access to safe abortions for everyone. I mean a next generation of health care providers who can serve patients both in bricks and mortar health centers as well as telehealth. For now, everyone is left waiting and wondering till the final ruling is released, which is still potentially months away. In Walnut Creek, Sharon Katsuda, NBC Bay Area News.